Good morning, everybody. I'm supposed to be a blessing. This is a reading for my Scorpios. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. We're going to get right into your reading. What's definitely heading your reading for today is you have to have faith in regard to some things. They're saying that your future is going to be bright, and you have a lot of dreams that's definitely going to be coming true. You just have to have a positive attitude in regard to the things. Even though you may be going through a challenging time, they said there is going to be some light at the end of the tunnel, even even though it may not appear that way they're also saying that the end of a situation they will bring relief um there will be an end of sadness or both you're gonna have some opportunities that's coming in for happiness you're gonna have, be able to drop this weight that's been on your shoulders for a very long time some of you're gonna be um having to deal with some type of addiction that you have okay and also What's heading your reading is the moon card, which is saying you need to listen to your intuition and pay close attention to the signs from the divine. Unnecessary worry. Let go of your fears. Revelations that will make everything okay. Okay, now let's get into your reading. Your first card that came out for you is the Ten of Wands. Some of you are definitely carrying heavy loads is what this card means. It also feels like you're feeling some type of way in regard to some things. But I want you to know that this, this is going to be ending for you soon. You can put down your words. You don't have to worry so much anymore. All right? Um, you're going to have a lot of ideas that's going to be coming in, and you're going to have to write your vision, make it plain, whatever it is, there's some clarity and truth that's going to be coming your way, and it's a great thing. Some of you may be telling somebody right off, telling them where they can go in regard to something. You don't have to put up with any mess that you don't want to. You've definitely been weighing your options in regard to some things, and uh, make sure you choose what's best for you. Some of you could be stuck. You're not moving forward or backwards in regard to a situation, but they're saying that... You need to look outside yourself in order to get the answer you need. You need to take time to med meditate. Some of you need to, uh, some type of healing in regard to some things. Even though you're looking good, you're keeping a lot of things deep down inside that a lot of people don't even know about. Uh, Worration and things like that. But you need to stop doing that because what that's doing is just messing up your body and the inside. That's right. Of your word, you know that pressure does bust a pipe, right? So... Um, just give it to the universe and let the, your spirit, your guides, your ancestors, your wishes, they will work this out for you. You're going to have to walk away from mess. Anything that's stressing you out, anything that's giving you any trouble, you got to walk away from it. I mean, if it's not benefiting you, what's the point in having it? Stand in your strength. Just to believe in yourself. You could definitely be dealing with the Leo here. You also know that things are going to definitely work out in your favor. There's justice for anything that if, if somebody does somebody unjust. It could definitely work in your favor. You definitely could be dealing with a Libra individual. You could be dealing with somebody who's working in the judicial system. Get ready for things to balance out for you here. All right, you have a earth sign individual, a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn who could be coming towards you. You could be dealing with them already. You also could be dealing with the Leo, Sagittarius, or they could be coming um, toward you or back into your life. The high priestess is it. She said, follow your intuition in regard to some things. Keep some things, some secrets until they have been man made manifest so that nobody can't come up against it because a lot of people don't want to see a lot of people happy in regard to some things. This is you and your own energy. You're sitting there. I mean, you're very mature. You're very silent. Like it. You know, you're good and you're kind-hearted and all this sort of stuff, but you give too much of yourself. you got to stop giving so much of yourself. Take more, better care of you, and then, because without you, how are you going to take care of somebody else? You see what I'm saying? Not saying change who you are, but just um, try to reevaluate some things, okay? You need to move on to calm and water some regard to some things because, see, you're up and down, you're worried about some situation. Things you can't do shit, nothing about. I'm trying not to cuss because these are angel cards, but y'all know my mouth shit. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you guys, um, you're up at night, you're worried, you're stressing in regard to something. It said, unfounded fear, expecting the worst, thus creating self-fulfilled prophecies, a long word to grow out of proportion to a situation, sleepless nights. You see what I'm saying? You got to refocus your thoughts, is what they said. That's right. That's why I say think positive. 
Um, don't dwell down below. I was trying to think with the high mind in regard to things. I know sometimes it's hard to stay positive when things don't really be going your way, but you got to try to make some things happen. I feel like you're going to have some blessings coming in. This is a fire sign going to come in. I feel like you're very passionate in regard to some things. You're also creating some things as well. I see a lot of blessings coming your way here. Look at that. Financial blessings is coming your way, Scorpios. And I also feel like You've been defending yourself against a lot of people, and I see you standing your ground in regard to some things. That's why people come at you, you know what I'm saying? You stand your ground, protect yourself at all costs. Because this card says, it says, protect what you have created. Be prepared and never give up. Ask your angels for help. Environmental activism and animal rights. Whatever you believe in, you stand up for it regardless and keep it moving. Because that could be your path. You know, you don't want to go off your path. Because then that's when you get to stress and when you're not on the right path that you're supposed to be on. All right, Scorpio, as well, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. Remember, I'm supposed to be a blessing. If you're looking for your own personal reading, call me at 347-227-5723. With that being said, Scorpio, talk to you tomorrow. Thank you, guys.